you couldn't tell me anything from the Bible. I didn't want to hear it. Um, I just did not want to hear it. I believe that it was just an indoctrination tool, things of that sort. And I've done re I was like, you know what? There's there's stuff from Sumer. There's stuff from Egypt that is in the Bible. And I think that they just stole that type of stuff, right? So I started reading on it. I started looking into the books of the dead. I've read the Emerald Tablets. I've read a decent amount of the Nag Hammadi Library. I've read the entire Epic of Gilgamesh, the Enuma Elish. When I tell you I went on a, I went crazy trying to learn this stuff. You got all these people talking about the Anunnaki and Nibiru. I've read it, I've, I've read it. I even studied the rites and rituals that they used to use in ancient Egypt. I even went over to the Hindu culture and studied the Rig Vedas. Look, people have been wondering, okay, so then what happened before the flood? It's literally in the complete Apocrypha. The books of Enos, Jasher, all this stuff is in, in the book of uh, Enoch and in, in, in the complete Apocrypha. You have to just trust me when I tell you all this third eye stuff, all that st in the Bible, all of it is in the Bible. We just have not been taught how to view the Bible. And I've had the veil unlifted, man. When I tell you I've went crazy studying this stuff, studying Masonic literature, studying Manly P. Hall, studying the Kabbalion, studying all the Hermeticism, all of that stuff. I've studied it intensely. I've studied the Illuminati. I've studied all of it, all of it. The, the Jews who are descendant in South America or North America, these influencers, First off, they're not going to tell you because they're going to be like, oh, man, I was wrong. I'm not I'm not going to tell all my followers this. They're going to keep deceiving you. Don't listen to these rappers. Don't listen to these influencers. They've all sold out. I'm telling you the truth. They all sold out. The mark of the beast to these rappers. Don't listen to these influencers. They've all sold out. I'm telling you the truth. They all sold out. The mark of the beast. E Elon Musk is that guy. He's going to be that guy that implements. He's going to bring the guy. He's you couldn't tell me anything from the Bible. I didn't want Hey guys, thank you so much for returning to my channel. This is your girl, Nitra P. So today's video is called Judgment. And before I talk about this, I'm going to invite the Holy Spirit in. Holy Spirit, just speak through me, use me, and guide me. And let my words be not mine, but yours only, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah and amen. All right, so the Holy Spirit was putting on my heart... Because I was trying to figure out which way I wanted to post these. Um, I was writing down my video ideas and all my notes that I need to point out on the videos. The points that I need to talk about. And so then he just kind of like had me talk about judgment on America. And what happens. And then he also had me go into another part. Which we're about to get into here in a moment. I don't really want to say too much. Because it's it's just going to be really, really good information. Um so america is being judged and then we also want to talk about how the state of california is being judged now the state of new york is being judged now the state of florida is being judged now uh georgia and maui um so also the holy spirit was gonna wanted me to say when the people reject jesus and god and his word in his word he said that he will give those people over to a wicked ruler or wicked rulers. And then um, that's in the word. And then also the word of God says it's kind of similar to how in the word in Timothy, it says that um, when people continue to rebel and deny and renounce uh, correction, that preachers that God sends to them to correct their actions, he sears their conscience with a hot iron and they will be given over to their lust to destroy themselves and be led to hell and damnation eternal. Um, but God came, he says in his word that God came to give life and life more abundantly. And that um, no man can come to the father except through him. And that anyone that comes to, to the father outside of Jesus Christ is a liar and a thief and that, um, yeah, basically, and then I'm going to add outside of that scripture, I'm going to say that he is illegally um, uh, at trying to access righteousness, holiness, and heaven, really. Um, and that's where you get different faiths and religions that the enemy devil has created in this world, in every single culture all around the world, to distract, to, to, distract, to destroy, and to steer, steer people away 
from the light, the truth, and the glory, and the love of Jesus Christ. There's no love greater than the love of Jesus Christ. You think you love your sister. You think you love your dad. You think you love yourself. You think you love your child. There is no love greater than the love that Jesus has for his creation. He loves us so, 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 so much. No matter what you've done. No matter what you've gotten into. Um, but yeah, so here I have written down. Um, I'm going to add this video in to talk about it but he's gonna talk about a bunch of stuff and then i'm gonna um basically come back in and talk about it so uh yeah um basically he was what he was saying about that in that video is just basically what you just heard and i'm gonna say new age atheism ancient commit is really all twisted truths mixed in with a lot of lies and secrets taught by evil spirits and then that's where I put in that video. So, guys, I just I just admonish you, which means I urge you and I want to give you the push to stop denying the, the deity of Jesus Christ. Um, he's real. We all don't have any, you know, health in our body, movement in our feet and hands and legs and food in our, our refrigerators and um, safety. And, and, you know, we can drive we can get around, we can, you know, go to work. All of these things we only have because of God giving us the power and the way and the, the body and the opportunities to be able to do so. So um, he loves you and I appreciate you guys for listening today. Thank you so much for returning to my channel. I love you. Jesus loves you. Shalom. And mwah. Bye.